What is up guys, Carl here. Today we're unboxing and having a first look at the CT or ZT Blade 3. This is a uh, less expensive uh, smartphone which is running ice cream sandwich, it's got a uh, 4 inch display and uh, just some general goodies for uh, a less expensive price tag. So let's get into the box itself. It's got some uh, pretty artwork. It's showing some uh, sights around the world, around the box. Nothing else, nothing really uh, too fancy pantsy on the box itself. No specs or anything. So let's pop it up and uh, let's see what's inside. Held together by two package tapings. There we go. Breaking the seals. And uh, let's pop it up from up here. I bought this phone myself because I need to put my little Galaxy S2 on service. So in the box itself comes in a few compartments. So start off with a uh, quick start guide. Shows you turn on the phone, plug your SIM in, charge it and all that. Next, we have a uh, micro USB connector used for, I guess, charging and for uh, data transfer. You have a uh, little wall adapter, which is instead of having the plug back here, you uh, plug it into a separate USB connector. That's first time I've ever seen that. Usually, a plug somewhere where you can plug it in. So. This one makes it a bit smaller compared to other ones. What else do we get in the box? You get one battery at, I uh, guess, 16, yeah, 1600 milliamp hours. So, should be okay battery life for it. I don't think it's too powerful. It's running a single core ARM Cortex A5, I think. So uh, it shouldn't pull too much battery in use. And let's have a look at the phone itself. And as I said, it's got a 4-inch display. As you can see, it's got some capacitive touch buttons down here. With we get settings or menu, home, back and search, looks like. You have the micro USB. A microphone. You have a come on, focus speaker on the back. You have a five megapixel camera, which can shoot, I think, uh, VGA quality. But I'm not sure about how the video is, and I won't be using it for that. But should you know, be okay for the price point it is at. You have a uh, volume rocker. You have the lock and I guess power button. You have your what is that? The small one. Got no idea. You got your uh, standard 3.5 millimeter headphone jack. No dedicated camera button, but we don't really need that. Nice to have sometimes, but uh, usually less buttons, less things that can break. So let's open this bad boy up. Can we open the battery latch with one hand? I guess not, so I'll pop that in and uh, get the battery up and running so you can see what the phone looks inside. OMFG! That took me about, I don't know, almost 10 minutes to get this thing off because it felt like I was gonna break it and almost felt like it was like glued on to the back, but you know if a little violence doesn't fix it, use more! So I plugged in the battery and uh, let's take this plastic off. Can we get that nice noise? No nice noise. No nice noise. But anyway, what I did forget to mention was that the phone also came with a uh, crap little... crap little headset. There's a model number if you want it, but um, I won't be using that. 
but it fell in my lap when I unboxed it. So it is there. And turn it on. It's the Android. Let's see how fast this thing is. A little red light up there. Probably tells me that I need to charge it. And get going. Come on, get going. Android. Let's see how fast it is. Come on. Come on. It came with a uh, 2 uh, gigs SanDisk microSD card. I won't be using that, but uh, it was plugged into the phone. I think the phone has a uh, 4 gig internal memory. So let's just skip, skip, skip. No, I don't want to use a network right now. Skip. Set date, yada, 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 not now. So, yeah, you can use my blast. Skip. Come on. Next. Next. Finish. So, this is what the phone looks like. See all the wraps? Touch the circle. Because if we touch that, you can get apps. Let's just have a look at how fast it is. Scrolling back and forth. And the web browser, you know, comes with the regular stuff. No web page available. Turning that on and off. Opens okay quickly. Guess you can... Oh, that's nice. Haven't seen that before. So you can sort by, uh, by different uh, sorting techniques. Time, top hit, alphabetic. You can scroll through your apps, you know. So uh, that's what the CT or ZT Blade 3 looks like. Thank you for checking out this uh, quickish unboxing and first look at it. And I'll see you next time.